Roomies, it's been a wild week in these internet streets so far, from Megan Good popping out with Jonathan Majors, to Tamar speaking on her breakup with her former fiance JR, and Diddy stepping aside from Revolt, is all the tea that's been spilled so far, so you know. It seems that ever since whispers started floating around about Megan Good and Jonathan Majors possibly being a couple, the internet has gone into a full investigation mode. Back in March, Jonathan Majors was accused by his ex-girlfriend Grace Jabari of domestic violence. Since then, not only only has Majors denied the accusations, but he is currently on trial facing misdemeanor assault and harassment charges. Some thought the whispers of him and Megan Good could have been a distraction from the trial or simply rumors that fans wanted to believe. However, it seems like things between the two are pretty official. In fact, Megan Good was seen hand in hand with Majors heading into the courtroom on day one of his trial. And while Megan made it a point to pop out and support her man, Tamar Braxton decided to open up about her own past relationship struggles. For those that may not know, Tamar and Jeremy J.R. Robinson met on the dating show Queen's Court and announced their engagement in March. However, the couple seemingly announced their split months later via separate social media posts. JR was even recently seen with Love & Hip Hop Atlanta's Tommy Lee at a basketball game on what seemed to be a date. Of course, social media had even more suspicions when Tamar and Tommy seemed to go back and forth with one another via subliminal story posts after Tommy Lee made a comment about one of Tamar's recent shows. One fan commented, The Shade Room comments never disappoint me. Somebody said Tamar and Tommy fighting over Tommy Jefferson. Another fan commented, he's stupid for even thinking it was okay for him to show up with Tommy. Let's be real, we all know Tommy Lee was hurt or bothered by her little exchange of words with Tamar Braxton and purposely chose to be seen with Tamar's 15 minutes of fame at dude to get back at her. Fans doubled down on the confusion after Tamar was seen with JR once again after her altercation with Tommy on Instagram. Following the social media post, Tamar Braxton went live, seemingly taking accountability for her role in her and JR's breakup. In the video, she said, we broke up because of me and even went on to discuss being in a better place and feeling the happiest she's been in a long time. While Tamar was busy taking accountability for her actions and speaking out on Instagram, it seems that he was trying to do a literary focusing on his own. At this point, most people are aware that Diddy, among several other celebs, have been hit with major sexual assault lawsuits following New York's Adult Abuse Survivors Act. Most notably, Diddy was sued by his former girlfriend Cassie for alleged rape and abuse during the course of their relationship, a suit that was ultimately settled just a day after it was announced publicly. Following the news of the settlement and other alleged victims stepping forward, it was revealed that Diddy decided to temporarily step down as chairman of Revolt. Of course, the news got fans fans talking and speculating about what could be going on behind the scenes. One fan wrote, Cassie didn't just sue Diddy, she sued him and every corporation he owned and served as an officer or director. So she tapped into commercial and officer director liability, which are usually over $1 million each, and Diddy can't say refuse to settle, it's in the insurance to decide. Neither Diddy nor his team has released any additional information about his decision to step down from his position at Revolt. What are your thoughts, roomies? Are y'all here for the Megan Good and Jonathan ship or Tamar's revelation post-breakup? And do you think there could be more behind Diddy's decision to step down? Roommates, thanks for watching TSR So You Know of the Week. Share your thoughts in the comments and don't forget to subscribe. Keep watching so you know.